so hello guys welcome to my channel today we are going to talk about location facility layout so we will study about reasons for location decision needs and importance of location decision factors affecting location selection which is affecting in service organization and affecting in manufacturing organization in the region community and site next we have techniques of location analysis qualitative and quantitative now first we have reasons for location decision so location decision is the process of determining the geographic site of company's operations facility location has its own characteristics availability of raw materials and labor is important the basic reasons to location decision is to set up the first premises expanding the firm to set up new branches changes in the technology of new technology shift in geographical demand occurs change in socio political and economic and government policy so need and importance of location decision so location decision have impact in the investment requirement such as operating cost and revenue and operations poor choice leads to excessive transportation cost shortage of qualifies labor which results in loss of competitive advantage and inadequate suppliers of raw materials so planning decision are the following reasons so availability of availability and cost of resources which is labor and raw materials geographic of demand may shift for a better facility new added market results in added capacity to be located development of new technology and socio economic and political government policy may change factors affecting the local selection so managers can divide the location factor into dominant and secondary factors so dominant factor are derived from competitive priorities such as cost quality time and flexibility the secondary factor are important but the management may ignore some of the secondary factors like factors affecting in the service sector and factors affecting the manufacturing organization like selection of region community and site so first talking about the factors affecting the service organization so it is mainly focused on the impact of location of the sales and customer satisfaction customer care about how close a facility is so this process requires considerable customer contact so there is proximity to customer so here location determines how convenient customer can carry the business few people choose the remotely located dry cleaner or supermarket in order to influence of the location tends to be dominant factor there is uh, transportation cost for the warehousing and distribution operation transportation and proximity of the market are important many firms can hold inventory closer to customer reducing the delivery time and promoting the sales next we have location of competitors so estimating the sales potential of different location in impact of competitors management must consider the location of competitors but also to anticipate their reaction to the firm's new location avoiding the area where competitors are already established payoffs so new car sales fast food chains locating near the competitor is advantageous next we have a site specific factor where retailer must consider the level of retail activity residential destiny traffic low site visibility so retail activity is concerned with the shoppers decide to go for shopping or eat in restaurants traffic flow or visibility is concerned with the customer ar arrivals in the car and visibility is concerned with the involved distance from the street and the size of nearby building now coming towards factors affecting the manufacturing organization so there are three selection so selection of region or the area there must be availability of raw material location of the market labor supply transportation facility power sources and government policy for the selection of the community there must be consideration of labor facility quality of life community and labor attitude local taxes and restriction and other factors for the selection of site there must be easy availability of cheap land transportation facility disposal of waste material water supply risk of uncertainties now coming towards first 
selection of region and area availability of raw material manufacturing engage in conversion of raw material into the finished product it's, it is essential that it should be located in the place where supply of raw material is associated assured at minimum transportation cost the farm located near the sources of raw material is for three reasons necessary perishability and transportation cost mining operations and farming forestry fishing all fall under it next the advantage of it is there is reduced transportation cost regular supply of material saving cost of storage of material saving the cost of uh, storage of material next we have location of the market management must select the location for the facility that will supply the demand location near the market is important when final goods are in the mass heavy bulk and transportation cost is high so location near the market intend to serve as competitive strategy non profit organization choose the location relative needs to of user of service next we have labor supply so cost and availability of labor wage rate in area labor productivity and attitudes towards the work labor cost is important for labor intensive organization work attitude towards the turnover absenteeism differs among the potential location where workers in the large or when so different attitude than the workers in the small town or rural area next we have transportation facility so transportation facility facilitate for the bringing raw material and men in the factory for carrying the finished product from market from factory to the market the connected rail road water transportation is ideal for the plant location well developed means of transport is used to attract so coming towards the power sources coal electricity oil natural gases are the sources of power factory has to be located near the coal field industry using technique electrically have to be located where electric power is available at cheap rates next we have government policies government policy and program on the plant in every country that is plant economy like ours and next is to generate reasons economy and large national economy now in selection of the community the community try to attract a new business and offering with the financial and other incentives as they view as potential sources of future tax revenues and new job opportunities so labor tax labor facility despite mechanization and automation labor on the industrial side not been lost completely labor is important factor in production of the goods nepal has availability of adequate labor at cheap rates the labor may be skilled or unskilled skilled labor influence the plant location unskilled labor is supposed to be available everywhere so coming towards the quality of life good school recreational facility cultural events contribute the quality of life more than 50% of new industrial jobs are being shifted to northern urban area as urban area is high cost of living high crime rates the general decline in quality of life next community and labor attitude so community attitude towards their work and prospective can make and destroy the industry community towards the supporting trade union are important criteria facility location is not desi desirable even though all the factors are favorable cause the labor attitude towards the management which may bring strikes and lockdown so coming towards local taxes and restriction local authorities collect charges for the supply of electricity and other facility collect taxes from the various industrial units it imposes restriction on the location of the new units in the public interest so other factors include room for the expansion construction cost accessibility to the multiple modes of transportation cost of suffering people cost of handling the material plants insurance cost competition from the farm the flexibility facility location in the country serves to avoid the problems such as related to the trade barrier like tariff and quotas now selection site so easy availability of cheap land 
so land is the basic necessity for the construction of the new plant for the factory established analyze availability and cost of land water supply the facility of water supply plays a fair vital role role in the manufacturing production so before deciding any site for the factory established manager should analyze adequate water supply facility transportation facility speedy transportation facility is needed for the regular and timely supply of the raw material at low cost and finished products to the market on the time transportation facility with a good speedy capacity is needed for transporting laborers in local sites now disposal of material waste so the problem of disposal is effluent to many industries like chemical sugar steel and leather industry it must be enough vacant land for dumping the solid waste for the liquid waste sewer connection river should be available risk of uncertainties so farm must face fluctuations in the demand for their product and adjust policies and strategies in order to survive and maintain the position in the market before deciding any site for the factory established man manager should have analyzed the risk and uncertainties in the particular site techniques for the location analysis there are two techniques qualitative and quantitative under qualitative we have simple comparative chart and factor point rating system under quantitative technique we have center gravity method or bp analysis and transportation method so qualitative technique so it cannot be measured in terms of money and can't be expressed in the terms of numerical value first we have simple comparative chart so the technique of analyzing the intangible factor for selecting the facilities location intangible factor affect the location like labor supply business climate attitude union the factors are compared as good bad suitable favorable unfavorable importance here the location b is the best among a and c as we can see in location a it is suitable good for location b there is more suitable and very good and for location c it is unsuitable and worse so among a and b the b is more preferable next we have factor or point rating system it is used for evaluating the wide range of intangible factor associated with the location most applicable and widely used method so simple comparative chart method does not break down the factors into the sub factor but the factor rating me method break down the factor into sub factor for evaluation and analysis first step 1 there is identifying the sensitive factor like direct material labor tax power step 2 there is the rate of each factor from 1 to 5 as 1 is very poor and 5 is very good then we select the highest score so analysis of location under the factor rating method we can see over here so in terms of factors like direct material climate transport and taxes location and the factor rate is compared so location rate is 5 then factor rate 2 climate 4 factor rate 3 transportation 3 factor rate is 5 for taxes 2 factor rate can be given 4 for the location for the location b we can compare similarly the location rate and the factor rate factor rate is given by us and location rate is automatically we assume that this will be good for this location so we multiply the location rate with the factor rate and we get the total and jo adding all the total from the location a and location b we can see here location a total is 45 and b is 37 so we select a next we have quantitative technique so it is measured in terms of money and expressed in the terms of money and numerical value so first we have center gravity method such technique of quantitative method is used for such as warehouse and distribution center so bp analysis so there is the use of cost volume analysis to make the economic comparison of the location alternatives the identifying fixed and variable cost and grouping them each location 
determine which provide the lowest cost it can be done mathematically and graphically so over here we can see the location fixed cost and variable cost so the to total cost calculated is for the 2000 units of the volume the total cost means fixed cost plus cost per unit into volume of production so for large part the total cost results 180000 for Baneswar 1,50,000, for Bautha 1,60,000. So Baneswar is the best location because it has the lowest cost. There is expected profit of like total revenue minus total cost. There will be 90,000. So over here, 90,000 will be the net profit where 120 is the selling price. So calculating over the crossover point for large impact and Baneswar, we can see fixed cost plus variable cost is equals to Baneswar's fixed cost and variable cost where X is 1000 units for Baneswar and both we compare same way and we get X value 2500 units.